today I'm gonna talk about the RTSP, that's the real-time stream protocol, it's very useful. If you want to stream videos from your IP camera to some cloud or some service like AngelCan for example, you can use RTSP. If you wanna learn more, just keep watching. Hello, welcome to my channel, Claudemir here, and today I'm gonna teach you how to get the RTSP URL from your IP camera. I use a software like this one, the Onviv Device Manager. I'm gonna teach you how to use it. But before I continue, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, hit the bell notification to receive more information about videos like this one, leave your comments and your thumbs up. Okay, so here I have the Onviv Device Manager, and I have some cameras here on my network already. So when I open this software, it looks for cameras. The first thing I have to do is make sure that I have the user and password here that the software is going to use to connect to the camera. Of course, here I'm gonna type my username and password for my camera. It's the same that you use in your camera. Let me type here and then I just hit login. And when I find my camera, let's say this one, uh, it's already working, as you can see here, I got live video from this software. So basically that's all you have to do. And if you take a look here, you see the RTSP URL. So it's pretty easy, you can test it out. It, you can just copy it and then you come here and use a software like the VLC. You can download this software from the internet, it's free, all right? So come here to media open network stream and you just paste it here. Let me just right click and paste. And then I hit play, ask me for the user and password. Let me type it here. Here we go. And I hit okay. And here we go, have the stream from the camera. Let me just resize this. And here we go. That's the stream directly from the camera using the RTSP. And it works with different cameras. If you want to try different camera, you just need to come here. Let me log out and use the password for the other camera. Okay, because they have different password. Let me try here. Where is the camera? I think that's the one. Here we go. In this particular situation, the software can't get the video from the camera. So the TSP on this camera. Uh, I think there is some issue there with the firmware. I will try to update this camera later, but in any, any way I can grab the RTSP URL here and try it out. I can open another VLC here, media, open stream network, and adjust paste it here and hit play. As you can see, I can grab the video. Let me just resize here again. That's another camera that I have just right here on my network. Okay, so for some reason, uh, uh, on this device manager, it didn't get the video, but got the URL. That's more most important for me. So I have both camera here running under VLC, camera number one and camera number two. Okay, so VLC can test them out and then I can use the URL for whatever reason I want to. And you can notice, notice that they are different. This URL is different from this one. So that would be different for any camera, okay? So that's all for today, guys. I hope that helps you. And I also ask you to subscribe to this channel, leave your comments, your thumbs up, and I see you in the next video.